it's something that took me some time to get used to you know i was making this mistake if you are a guy or a husband see watch this video because you can also tell your wife or your girlfriend how to actually take care of their coochie okay how to take care of their their, their you know the hair on their pubic area you can actually tell them all right so guys i'm going to be telling you guys some things here that you are going to be doing to get that freshness you know to be as if is um you are you no, know, you went to wax. You know, that place is not going to be getting dark. I have a lot of customers that they're going to be snapping and be telling me that Ella, what am I going to use on this particular area? Okay. So guys, let me show you. Number one thing is you get a very very soft scrub. I'm going to be putting three to four different scrubs here. Not your hair scrub, not your sugar scrub, not your like an apricot scrub. A very very soft scrub. That is the first thing before you shave just use that scrub to massage that particular area you know the front the corner use it to clean that area a safe scrub please don't go and buy uh, all this uh, ashanti scrub oh, and use no or this uh, crusade scrub no 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 all those scrubs are not for that area so these scrubs i'm putting on the screen here those are the tested and the trusted scrubs that are very 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 mild on the skin and you're going to love it it's going to very mild on that area and please don't go and shake it inside just on the surface of where you have hair all right so after you have done use the scrub just wait for like two to five minutes then you use your water and rinse it off guys okay exfoliation is the first thing you do guys so after you have exfoliated that area you can shave all right so that that place all the oil all the excess oil all the you know dirty areas are going to be cleaning up all right you can shave the way you are done shaving all right use your aloe vera did you get me do you know that when you are done shaving you are still going to go and take your bottle i'm just showing you guys a cleanliness like you can do this once in a month just take that full day for that particular area. Please, may your, may your husband or your boyfriend chop better thing. I'm telling you guys, you will look so fresh. Not that you'll be smelling, your pants will be smelling like fish. Ah, please now. Not only taking care of your skin, also take care of your inner body. Take care of that particular area. It's really, really important. So you have to rub your aloe vera on that particular area. After you've rubbed your aloe vera, let me show you. This is the aloe vera here on the screen. Just take a little bit of aloe vera and rub. I'm not asking you to go and pluck aloe vera in your backyard and start using the gel. It's going to scratch you mad. <laughs> it's going to scratch you. So please don't use that aloe vera. Use this one on the screen here. I've talked about this aloe vera, okay? And secondly, to be fair, when they buy their shaving stick, they will use it one month, two months, three months, four months. They will just, after using, they will go and wash it and keep it again. Please. I was doing that before. I am also among those people, but I have changed. <laughs> so, when you use your shaving stick, it's not expensive, 300 one month 300 uh -huh. just go and get a new shaving stick after you have used the shaving stick trash it get a new shaving stick i told you guys whatsoever i am doing on my skin i must give it to you guys back to back i'm not go shame if that the breast so i will tell you that this is the breast issues if you see this is the area i have done and it is super super nice super super clean like easy, we can't even sleep there. <laughs> I hope you understand. So give your man something that is good, something that is clean. Don't be dirty. Okay? So you shave and you trash that shaving stick. Don't use the same shaving stick again, please. I'm begging you. You can shave your armpits and your hair at the same time. And I noticed something about some people. When they are shaving, like they shave this week. And they will shave the next week. Those things are going to cause ratchets, bumps on your on your on your coochie. It's going to cause those things there. Please don't go and start using 
all these things on your cushion. Don't go and start shaving every week, every week. At least give yourself like two weeks. Okay? I shave every three weeks. That was That is how I do mine. You can shave two weeks if you know you grow hair a lot. Me, I grow hair too much. But I still try to shave three weeks. I won't grow hair yet. So you guys can know how hairy I am. So I actually shave every three weeks. Before I shave every week, it costs me bombs. Like it makes that place darker. And it does not look nice. It does not look fine at all. Can you can you just wear a bikini or can you just even open your body and walk around your husband, you know, without covering it? Because it's not looking fine. It doesn't need to look fine, okay? So shave two times in a week, uh, two weeks, like in two weeks, shave once or three weeks. Give it like three weeks. Three weeks is the best, okay? Three weeks is the best. I do my three weeks. It's actually the best, guys, okay? So after you have used your, um, your aloe vera, you wash, you clean it off, okay? Leave your aloe vera there for like five minutes. It's very cold there, okay? Your hair. Some shave it down, some are down, some are up. So try and check the, you know, the direction your hair is going. Like my own is down. I shave down, okay? Alright? I have a cousin, her hair is up, like up. So you shave up or you shave down. Don't shave up and down. I said that in my former video. I said that, you know, if you are trying to make your, you know, like your armpits, you want it to be very, very clean, stop shaving back and front, up and down, okay? Just shave. If you are shaving down, shave just down. Then if you are shaving up, shave up. Don't go up and down, okay? That is the next thing we are talking about. This is a very, very important thing in women. Now, they think I say now only skincare just to look fine and come outside. No, now. What if the man can't ask you, okay, are you a poo? What are you going to do? So that is another one. Please, just shave only down, okay? Or up. One, no do two. Me, I cannot tolerate uh, waxing, no. I can feel pain. Even to play this hair, hey, I almost cried. To show you that, I feel pain a lot, okay? Then the next thing you do is, you get your Vaseline. Once you are out from your bathroom, because that place will be dry. Don't go and use your body cream or go and, go and use the uh, Vaseline. Use Vaseline, that jelly, um, <coughs> that petroleum jelly Vaseline. Or you use baby oil, uh, um, Johnson baby oil, or use your Vaseline. Okay? And use it to moisturize that area, babe. Like, if you do this for just one month, you will start seeing sweet results. That place will be looking so clean, so beautiful. And don't forget your feminine wash. That is my go to go. Don't forget your wash. I showed you two different kinds of wash in my former video. Go and watch that video. I know how to take care of your coochie. Alright? So, I love you all, guys. I love you so much. If you have watched this video to this extent, you love this video, you love me also, please subscribe to my channel. Like my video. Share my video. Okay? Till we meet next time. See you guys. Bye-bye.